My lord, please help. The Mongols forced my master to craft a set of armor for Kutum Khan himself. It's not enough for him to conquer our home. He has to steal from our people as well. When my master finished his creation, he saw a chance to run. He fled with the armor. Where did he take it? He hid two pieces of it on different farms, far apart from each other. And the others? The Mongols got them. They found your master before he hid the rest. When he refused to tell them where to find the missing parts, they executed him. I'll find every piece of that armor and avenge your master's death. He'd be honored for you to wear the armor, my lord. Bring the pieces back to me, and I'll be sure they fit you properly. Lord Sakai! We could use the old road from Omi up through Fort Camino Dake. Only problem is it's held by Mongols. You need help to drive them out. I know some hunters camped on Mount Sago. Their leader's named Takashi. Friend of yours? No, but he'll do anything I ask, and his men are good archers. While you're meeting them, I'll slip through your uncle's castle. Meet our friends in Omi. Lead them to strike the fort from the south. I'll attack from the north with your hunter friends. You think it'll work? Yes. Be careful, you know. You too. You're welcome at our campfire, my lord. Are you Takeshi? You know my name? I'm Jin Sakai. Yuna sent me. She's alive? Where is she? The Mongols blocked the pass to Omi. I have to open the way and I can't do it alone. Yuna told me you can help. <laughs> Sounds dangerous. I thought you were an expert hunter. Leader of the best archers in the prefecture. Is that what Yuna told you? She thinks you care enough to fight. Is she wrong? About me? No. But my people need a reason to risk their lives. It's going to be a cold winter. Why spend it on a mountainside hunting squirrel when you can live in a warm fort? If we can stay till spring, we're in. You have a deal. 
This won't be like hunting wild boar. Come over here and you'll see. We should be out hunting the Khan. Mongol archers guard the gate. Patrols ride in and out all day. If we can get in from this side, Yuna and the rest of my friends will hit them from the south. Yuna will be there? All right. The fort was built around the cliffs. We can use them to get inside. Woodcutter camp. Supplied lumber to the fort. Haven't seen anyone there since the Mongols showed up. How good are you at climbing? Better than average. Time to head for the woodcutter camp. but it took hours. If we sit up here much longer, the Mongols are sure to see us. Back away from the edge. I'll be right up. Sure you will. Yuna's got some interesting friends. Let's plan our attack. You can see inside from over here. Archers on that ridge will have a good view of the courtyard. And plenty of targets. The bulk of our force should go there. We'll get on that roof. Control the high ground. <laughs> you sound like Yuna. She was a good teacher. <laughs> you men with me. Everyone else, get to the ridge. If the enemy sees me, take them down. Understood. Good luck.
What sort of animals would do this? The Mongol kind. The woodcutters must have resisted them. Let's kill every bastard in this fort. Another patrol. We'll ambush them when they come through. Hide. You heard him. Move! Open fire on my signal. <laughs> Closer. Come on, let's get to the bridge. I heard Lord Shimura has an army with samurai from the Shogun. Why aren't you leading them? Lord Shimura has his plan to fight the Mongols. That came from the southern gate. Got to see what's happening. Yuna! She did that? We have to get over there. Let's get a look at the bridge. across the bridge. We'll have to deal with that Huacha quickly. Could you sneak under the bridge with that hook of yours? Take the Huacha by surprise? I could grapple onto the tree and swing across. There's a way up the cliff on the other side. If they spot you, we can hit them with arrows. Charge across or sneak over. Either way, it'll be risky. We'll follow your lead, Lord Sakai. Get your people ready to move. 